Oh, I do love Christmas. Jingle bells, jingle bells. Hey Optimus, do you need any of these stocking thingies? Um, Jazz, you're not meant to be in this movie, it's... Not got you in it, remember? You're dead. I... I'm dead? Yep. Well, how come I don't remember? Well, you're dead. Hey! You! Get off the set! Just before I move you off! Um, Michael you're not meant to be in this scene either. I'm not? Well, see you, Prime. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, Megatron, and a Happy New Year. Right, the trimmings are up. Nothing else to do. Wait. Ha, 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 ha. Wait, I mean. Ho, 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 ho. I have a plan. An evil, deadly plan. Do you ever think that Optimus celebrates Christmas a bit too much? Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas everyone! Prime, we all know it's you behind there. You do? Well pretend you don't, and then the others won't know it's me. We all know it's you, Optimus. Oh. Okay then. Anyway, I love Christmas. And I love Father Christmas. Where's my turkey? I left it here somewhere. Yum. It was a very nice dinner this is time. I didn't know you had such great cooking skills. You didn't? Oh. Ah, very lovely Prime. Megatron, please shut up. Anyway, goodbye everyone. Oh, I do love c Christmas. That dinner was delicious. Let me just cross my Christmas calendar. Okay, cross Christmas day of my calendar. Wait, it's Christmas Eve? Ah, I thought it was Christmas Day. <sighs> ah, you need to cook again tomorrow. Okay. Ah, what a lovely dinner once more, Prime. Thanks, Megatron. Please come back next year and to all of you. Merry Christmas. Ho 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 <coughs> ho <coughs> ho 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 Merry Christmas. No, Megatron. What have you done? You are the future to reclaim a new world. You are the rising shadow of the darkness who shall slay us. The weak, and you shall control lightning like a cloud. We've already lost. Prime, but we can still fight it, Optimus Prime. Can't we? Against the rising darkness be? I don't know. <laughs> Optimus, I see you have worked out the riddle. It's a pity that you won't see to survive our new world. Soundwave falls the nemesis and strike Autobot movement around their base. I shall reclaim 
the base once more. No, watch it. Guards the prisoners, that lightning shall create a pause, freeing the prisoners. No, it's too late. However, Autobots, prepare to your battle stations. Real Jack and Ratchet put ZTR inside the base. We shall get to Ab. Autobots, run! Wait. Oh boy, it's that time again, everyone! Do you have any idea where Optimus went, you guys? Well, wherever he is, B, you better be quick, because I'm not waiting here all day for him. Hey, you. Where have you all been? And where's Prime? He was supposed to be here, and we were supposed to finish this episode today. I have no clue, but you did say it's that time again, so... True. Ah, oh, but do any of you know where he went? No. I do. Remember last year when it was Christmas, and he said he had an evil, deadly plan to cook Christmas dinner? And you, Bumblebee, you told him that it was Christmas Day, instead of Christmas Eve so we had to cook again the next day when you said you had to cook again tomorrow well it looks like he's doing it again okay Megatron release your sky upgrade I have a more evil plan than Optimus what is the Transformers from 5000? what is your plan? to help him ha 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 oh no I did the same as Optimus last year. I said ha ha instead of ho ho. Okay. Ho 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 ho. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, you. Optimus, I have an evil plan. What could it possibly be? To help you, Optimus. Oh, yes, yeah. Forget Project Dark Sky, we have a meal to finish. Wait, um, Transformers from 5000? Um, you're meant to be filming this. Wait a minute, Jimmy! Wait, is it called Jimmy? No, wait, Starscream! Film this, please. Now I'm hungry, meal time. Um, okay then, let's put it on automatic filming. Everyone ready? Christmas week isn't over yet, Transformers Fan 5000. Now check. We still need to put the decorations up first. Haha, <laughs> lol. Well, it looks very good. Oh, oh, yes, it's Christmas Eve. It's going to be Christmas tomorrow. Yes! Oh, boy, Santa's been here with everyone. Here, Megatron, this present's for you. But before all this, let's have the dinner. Oh, Prime, I'm stuffed. Oh, you do know this is Christmas Eve. What? Nah, am I joking? I got meal once again, Prime. Thank you, Megatron. Now, for presents. Ho, 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 ho. 
ho 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 Now let's open our presents. Here's a present for you, Prime. Thank you, Megatron. And thank you everyone. Thanks to all of you at home. Have a good, fun Christmas and I hope you get lots of presents to open when Santa comes to town. You do realise, Prime, it's back to filming again tomorrow, Prime. Really? Nah. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I hope you all enjoy Christmas this year. Merry Christmas. Let Optimus know that. Shh, shh, shh. Just don't say anything. There's something wrong, Bumblebee. Who was you talking to? Sam. But Sam isn't here. I just dropped him off back at his house. He ground bridged here. Then, where is he? Ratchet shrunk him with a shrink ray again. What shrink ray? Exactly. A gone. Any ideas, anyone? Hmm. Remember when Megatron came to the base and said, Come out and get your Christmas present and sideswap it fell for it? Let's do that. Are you fracking crazy? That will just remind Optimus it's Christmas. It's Christmas? Frag. Megatron, guess what? Duh, what is it now, Optimus? Christmas time has come once more. <coughs> yeah. Beep. Why did you blink then? Isn't that how humans swear? Well, kind of, yeah. But that's how I say. Finally, let's get the party on. What was you and Bumblebee talking about? The whole thing that Autobots and Decepticon army is gonna keep it to themselves that it's Christmas Day for me, but I'm not supposed to. Oh, for the love of Primus! It's okay, guy. You can come out. Holiday starting again. Why do you not want me to celebrate Christmas, Bumblebee? Hate to break it to you, Prime, but you celebrate Christmas way too much. I do not. Logical 
to celebrate Christmas even more. Please, that's like, wait, 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 what? Everyone, it's party time. Yeah. Come on, B. Give Christmas a try at least. I don't hate Christmas. I hate people who celebrate it. That's why. I cannot stand it. Why? What happened? You're supposed to give to the less fortunate at Christmas. So, the Decepticon prisoners, when we, what we captured when we were filming, we forgot to untie them after filming. So I went down to the Decepticon prisons to cook them a Christmas meal. And I threw it in my face. They embarrassed me in front of all Cybertronians. I'm sorry. Uh, wanna go for a ride, bud? Sure. Whoa! What just happened? Where are we? We are in the past. Is this what they did to you? Yes, Saucy. I'm sorry, but I gotta go. No, look at Now is this what happened? Yeah. Well, it's the thought that counts. It's better than nothing. Anything? Even nothing is better than getting the scrap kicked out of you and hung on a Christmas tree in front of everyone. You know what I meant. Now, to the present. Is there going to be ghosts in this Scrooge thingy, or is it just me and you? Me and you. Okay, then that's fine. Now look at him. He's enjoying Christmas. That's what you want, isn't it? For your leader and our friends to be happy at Christmas, right? So? So what? So are you going to celebrate Christmas? Hmm. Uh, yeah, just so. You watch. He'll be Ratchet, Flack, or Robot, or even Optimus Prime next year who's a grumpy Scrooge. Wouldn't you agree, Optimus? Um. Optimus? He can't see you. These are shadows of the present, past, and future. Can't touch them. We're basically not here. We are the ghosts. Hey, you lied to me. What? No, I did not. Yes, you did. You said there were going to be no ghosts. No, no. They exist in their own time. We are the ghosts. Oh. Okay then, shall we move on? Sure. Now, unless you change your ways, this is where you'll end up. In the next episode. The Decepticon Army? Never. Transformers Fan 5000 will never write that in the script. Never. Take me back. These are the vision of what may be, not what shall be, isn't it?
Yes, but unless you change your ways, it's back to being grumpy and evil and old. Eventually. Okay, okay. I'll celebrate Christmas. I'll not be a Scrooge. After all, it's about spending time with friends and family. Yeah. Let's go back to base. Finally. Whoa! We're back. Yay! Not a word to anyone. Our little secret. Hey, Bumblebee, over here. You ready for the Christmas dinner? <laughs> yes, I am. Me. And I'll see. Well, it looks like my work here is done. Optimus! What have you done? What? Whoa, B, remember! It's a base, not Santa's workshop. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Good job, anyway. Two years ago, remember? Two years ago, I tricked you, making you cook twice in two days. Since it was Christmas Eve, how about you all watch a movie, and I cook dinner tonight, and tomorrow. Payback for me making you cook twice last year, eh? You know how to cook, right Bumblebee? Oh yeah, piece of cake. How do you make cake? I'll see, will you help me? Sure, B. Thanks, Arcee. How about the Polar Express, everyone? Oh boy, yes. Uh, but I'll have to co cook. Well, I guess I can listen to it and just watch while it's cooking. So what shall we cook? Don't worry, Arcee. I have an evil plan. Ho ho ho, oh damn it. Ha 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 ha. I have a very evil plan. I shall cook that prime turkey. You don't even know how to cook prime style. No, really. There's such a thing as a prime turkey. Well, I think so. I think it's like the best quality of one. Anyway, I don't know. Let's just call it prime. <sighs> anyway, let's get to it. What are you doing, really? An invite to the North Pole to see the one and only Santa Claus. And you're turning it down, kid. Well, I guess he could be a kidnapper. Prime, here. B wants to give you this. A model of me? Thanks, Bumblebee. I really like it. Now let's serve up dinner and watch films and wait for the day. The day till all are one? No, I mean Christmas Day, B. Oh, right, uh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Can't believe I forgot about that. What's that noise? C could it be the Polar Express train? Well, you coming? Ultra Magnus? You're a train conductor? Me no no, Ultra Magnus. I just woke up from my recharge cycle. I don't want to play games right now. So, you're coming or not? Where?
right to the North Pole, of course. This is the Polar Express. I can't believe this is happening. It's gotta be a dream or something. I just watched this movie a few hours ago. Alright, Mags. I'll come along for the ride with you, sir. Awkward. Now I see why that kid thought about this. Many hours later, and we're still traveling. Scrap this. I'm going to the front of the train. This train better not be named Astro Train. Starscream? They hired you for this part. The ghost of Starscream. I ride this train for free, you know. <laughs> How about a nice hot cup of energon? Ghost of nothing if you don't shut up. Finally, we're here. There's Santa. Yes, there he is, and he shall pick you to open the first gift of Christmas. Really? Prime, you're not Santa. I am now. Okay. Oh, I have a present for you. Here's a sword thingy. Nice, yeah! Slice and dice. Now I look like the center of the Argus advert. Oh, well, at least I can scare some kids for Halloween. Oh, oh, oh I, I need. Oh, sorry. Face it, you needed to cut your beard anyway. We better get back. Ground bridge back to base. I shall deliver the kids around the world a present and come home, I'll see you. Yes, Prime? Merry Christmas. Same to you, Optimus. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Well, it's Christmas Day, everyone! Santa's been here! <sighs> What's up, Optimus? I missed him. Surely I got him on camera. Someone check. No, I missed him again. I think you'll find there's more to you than meets the eye. So there it is, as we celebrate Christmas opening presents and cooking dinner, we thank you for watching this Christmas special. Stay tuned until then. Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night.
Starscream, the Autobots are nearly defeated. This stupid outrage of who gets to be the hero in Season 3 remake shall be ours for deciding. Suffer my wrath! Uh oh. What am I even doing? My gun isn't spring loaded like all of yours. I guess Hasbro wanted me to be tough and use my fists as weapons. Quit that attitude, hardhead! Fine. If Hasbro wanted you to be tough, go be tough and start punching! Alright, who wants some? Uh oh. What is it? I was going to run out and fight, but I got a message from Optimus. Where is he anyway? You two. Can you two just shut the heck up? No, Optimus sent me a message. I'll read it out to you. Here goes. Sorry, can't come. Urgent message. P.S. Look at your calendars for this month. Great. What? What is so bad? It is only... Scrap. Scrap, 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 scrap! Not again! Einhard, I think we better go tell those Decepticons what's happening. Hold fire! What? I can't hear you due to the booming sound of the song! Soundwave, turn it off! Legendary Toy Fighters! The powers that created us now want us all extinguished! We must join forces, or I'll suffer another year of Christmas with Optimus Prime. Seriously? Optimus doesn't seem a Christmassy person. Not the Dawn of Corruption Prime. The Optimus Prime and Transformers Fan 5000's original Transformers seasons. I heard about him. Well, is he dangerous? No. It would seem that another year of Christmas is upon us. And Optimus, he goes overboard. Well, let's put our different opinions aside. Let's change the calendar to Boxing Day, the 26th of December, and make Optimus think he overslept Christmas Day. We're being deceptive and I love it. Agreed. Let's do it. Ah, Sideswipe. What do you think to the decorations? Uh, there's a lot? Optimus, I got that stash of 10,000 Christmas tree decorations for you. Perfect. 10,000? Optimus, let me break this to you. You need to hear this. Stop celebrating Christmas so much! Yes, these past years were over the top. No, they were not. I cooked two Christmas dinners one year. The other time, I interrupted the production of season 3's finale to put the decorations up around the base. And last year, I celebrated Christmas even more. And I gave up the first gift of Christmas to our scene. Precisely. You celebrate Christmas way too much. Hmm, well, uh, I guess Christmas is after all the time for giving. So... Well, why doesn't everyone go out and buy me some gifts? I am so done. Well, we got kicked out. Yes, trying to get Optimus to stop celebrating Christmas is not possible. So what are we gonna do? Well, instead of toy props, Transformers Fan 5000, made for Dawn of Corruption, Optimus has made real bombs, and stuck them to the base's door. So if one of us tries to stop Optimus from celebrating, we'll get blown up, and it will hurt. Having a break sure clears your head. Why are we outside? Well... Don't tell me. The decorations are up. Well, let's look. Megatron! No! no! Well... On the bright side, the door opens now. No! You will never stop me from celebrating Christmas. Oh. Oh.
I'm tired of this scrap. I have no other choice than to destroy Optimus and all of us with him. Ironhide, don't! You'll kill us! This ends here! Ugh. Did it work? You tried to kill me, Ironhide? Just because I celebrate Christmas? Yeah, I guess it didn't work. Ironhide, I've been blown up twice today. I believe we've learned a lesson today. And that's that the needs of the few outweigh the needs of the many. Christmas Eve, oh boy! Great. Well, the main thing is that no one was hurt. Too much. Where have you been? You were supposed to help us. Yeah, hey, RC, Optimus kind of persuaded us to tonight's Christmas Eve sleepover party. Uh, where is our Christmas Eve dinner? It's right here. Thanks for not killing me, everyone. The bomb Ironhide detonated actually knocked some sense into me. Now I know how to celebrate Christmas even more over the top. Last year, I was kidnapped by the Polar Express conductor who happens to be here. RC, why are you looking at me? Let's put a movie on. Who's up for watching one? What we gonna be watching, Prime? <coughs> anyway, to you at home, have a very Merry Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, everyone! Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, everyone! I'm telling you, Starscream, people won't see this as abomination as good. They'll see it as an unnatural cause. Don't be a coward! It's alive! You've created a monster! I'll be remembered for this as Dr. Frankenscream! <laughs> Let me stop you right there, Starscream. Why the heck are we talking about scary stories, when Halloween was like, two months ago? Well, I don't know. If Halloween was indeed a month or two ago, then it could only mean one inevitable outcome. What? Oh, come on! You've got to be kidding me! It's Christmas! Optimus, got those 20,000 Christmas tree decorations. You do realize this costs more money than what the whole U.S. government has, right? Magnus, I doubt that'll stop him from putting them up and buying some more. I tried to kill Optimus last year, and that didn't work. I don't think anything will stop Optimus from celebrating. You exaggerate. You shot me. You never blew me up. Optimus, don't tempt me. What are you guys talking about? Optimus got 20,000 Christmas tree decorations. Yep, I'm out of here. Wait! You never asked what to buy me for Christmas. How about a Christmas story? <sighs> what have we got to lose? Many years ago, before the time of Christ, an 
evil spirit walked the earth, the shadow of Santa. While Santa gave to the good, this spirit took the bad. His name was Krampus. So basically, he's the Nemesis Prime version of you? Indeed. He destroyed anyone who got in his way, no matter who it was. Man, I gotta sleep tonight with this thought in my head. Don't worry, I'm sure we'll be fine. It's Christmas Eve after all. What was that? What was that? Don't worry. It's probably teenagers. They wouldn't dare break in. We're in a highly defended base with machine guns, rockets, helicopters, jets, and... Optimus, we're toys made by Hasbro. We're not a fragging transformer. Defender of the Earth. Oh wait, I forgot. We are. What in the name of Hasbro was that? I don't think I want to know. Hide, everyone. It's... it's... Krampus. Ah. Every time we're with Optimus at Christmas, something always goes wrong. We have to defeat him somehow. Autobots, this may be our last battle. But rest assured, Christmas will go on. For we are... Are... I honestly did not think I'd make it this far. I was hoping Krampus would have found me by now. But we must defeat him. So who wants to do the honors? <sighs> You've got to be kidding me. I'm not fighting that thing. Oops, he saw you. Oh well. I, Optimus Prime, Defender of Christmas, will defeat you. Prepare to meet your doom. I think we might be able to defeat Krampus with good Christmas thoughts. Oh, now you tell me. I am the Christmas Devil, and it is time to face true evil. Krampus, that's quite enough. Santa! You recovered quick. Krampus, it's over. Never! Christmas is to be enjoyed. Not destroyed. That was good. Oh, my back. Is he? Krampus will return. But not until next year. You are safe. For now. That really doesn't help. Like, at all. Thank you, Santa. How can I repay you? Ho ho ho! Celebrate Christmas! I already do. Then celebrate it even more! <sighs> no nightmares, surprisingly. 
Happy Christmas, Megatron. Starscream Brawl Einheit. Let's get these presents open and have our Christmas turkey and dinner. Thanks for watching, and have a Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Something terrible has happened. Optimus Prime has stopped celebrating Christmas. No! No! But is all as it seems. Come on, Prime. It isn't like you to shy away at Christmas time. Ha! Huh. I have no time for this Christmas. I have more important things to do than decorate the base. Yeah? Like, what exactly? None of your concern, Bumblebee. Bumblebee? I'm not Bumblebee, I'm Ironhide. <laughs> First time we're all actually excited about Christmas and Optimus doesn't want to be involved at all. I was never interested in this time of year. That's debatable. Anyway, why have you changed your looks, your c colors, to really dark red and blue? Christmas is about bright lights, not a time for dull paintwork. Guys, guys, guess what? 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 It's Christmas Eve! What? Is it my pink pajamas again? We already knew that, Megs. If you don't all stop talking about Christmas, I'm leaving. Take it easy, big guy. We're only trying to celebrate Christmas Eve. Then celebrate without me. Goodbye. Whoa. Optimus couldn't actually teleport before, right? No. Oh well. It's Optimus's loss. Let him be a Scrooge. We'll all have to celebrate Christmas without him. Huh. <sighs> I like the sound of that! Broad, I think we should tell them. Yeah, but I don't just want to assume that Optimus isn't Optimus without evidence. You were with us last year when... when Krampus came. You know, Santa said that Krampus will return in a year's time. Also, did you see Optimus's new color scheme? It looks exactly like Krampus's did. And he also has the same body type that Krampus had. Yeah, yeah, you're probably right. There's way too many signs that Krampus is back and has been impersonating Optimus. And did you see how hesitant Optimus is to not celebrate Christmas? We all know that Optimus is a Christmas fanatic. Exactly. I'll, I'll tell everyone. Everyone, can I have your attention, please? Does anyone know the legend Krampus? I do. He kicked the scrap out of Optimus last year. <laughs> yes. Well, me and Starscream have reason to believe that Krampus has returned. We've noticed some things about Optimus lately that suggest that Optimus isn't, well, Optimus. RC, you noticed that Optimus has different colors than he did before. And Sideswipe, you knew that Optimus couldn't teleport before, right? My point is that last Christmas, Optimus told me, Starscream, and Megatron, the tale of Krampus, and the funny thing is, Krampus actually showed up that night and invaded the base. 
Anyway, Santa came and saved everyone, and after he said that Krampus will return in a year's time, and we've all noticed that Optimus is acting at different as of late, especially with him not celebrating Christmas. And what do you intend we do about it? We can't exactly fight Krampus with our plastic spring-loaded guns if he shows up now, can we? True, but we are here to protect, so we must find a way to stop- Oh my god, stupid teleporting systems! I'm getting too old for this. Santa? Boy, am I glad to see you. Ron, have you seen Krampus this year? He's returned. Yeah, we've noticed some strange things about Optimus lately. <laughs> All of your friends truly believe you've stopped celebrating Christmas. Such a shame. Soon my plans will be complete. And all who are upon this world will be destroyed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I go home now? I really don't want to miss Christmas. Miss it? Ha! Get used to it. I'm going to destroy Christmas. Yeah, thing is, Christmas is a season. You can't really destroy a season, you know. Stop people celebrating a season? Sure. But you can't really destroy a season. Shut up, just shut up. You talk too much. I know. It's one of my better qualities. Oh, I haven't captured you. Out of all the Autobots, I captured you, the annoying one. Wanna hear a joke? Knock knock. <sighs> Who's there? Christmas. <laughs> no, really. It's Christmas Eve right now. So Christmas is literally around the corner right now. I don't care. I'll destroy you, Optimus Prime. And all those years of you celebrating Christmas will have been for nothing. And that's why we think that Krampus has returned and has been impersonating Optimus. Krampus has gotten stronger since last year. And my back is weaker. But, Santa, how are we going to defeat Krampus? We need to rescue Optimus, and I bet all the children's toys that are in my sack that Optimus is being kept prisoner in Krampus' lair. I do not like the sound of that. Neither do I. The truth is, Krampus is my brother. Whoa, really? Yes, but that means we have an advantage. Krampus and I share a split spark, which means I know what he is planning and how we can defeat him. So what's he planning? I believe that Krampus is planning to destroy me and my sleigh. Thus, the children of the world will wake up in the morning to no presence. If that happens, then Christmas will never again come. Then we stop him! Yeah! yeah! I need help from all of you. I will teleport us all into Krampus's lair. You all rescue Optimus, while I face Krampus. Go! Free him! It's about time you got here. Be quiet. We can always just leave you here. Brother, it's time we finished this. Indeed! Okay, let's hear it. How long did it take for you guys to realize that Krampus was imposing as me? About a week? Maybe two? Maybe three? Maybe four? By Primus, really? How were we meant to know? You change your looks all the time. We thought you got a new upgrade or something. No, Santa! Me back! Oh. I'm coming, Santa. Everyone, surround Krampus. 
Give up, Krampus! You've lost! Big words coming from a toy in his Jim Jams. Yeah? If you knew how warm this kept me, you'd be begging me to let you wear it. Krampus, this time it's really over for you. Christmas will always be defended. Never! I'll destroy every one of you. Me back! Santa, please, get up. We can't do this without you. You can. You're the only one who can defeat Krampus. You have a true Christmas spirit within you. You have good Christmas intentions and thoughts. Everything that Krampus hates. Use that to defeat Krampus. It is your destiny. I did say last year to defeat Krampus with good Christmas thoughts. I knew I was right. You should have listened to me, Prime. Alright, Krampus. You can invade the base. You can even incinerate Megatron's pajamas. <sighs> Actually... But you don't hit Santa Claus. Don't tell me what to do. Oh. Oh. Give up. You're beaten. Not yet. The self-destruction sequence has already started. Oh dear. If I were to ever be beaten in my own lair, a self-destruct would automatically initiate and blow my lair and everyone in it to scrap. Santa, teleport everyone out of here. But Christmas, it's almost midnight and I haven't delivered all the presents yet. And my back is killing. Unless... Unless what? Optimus, I don't know how to tell you this, but I'm too old. We already knew that. And my back is aching. We knew that too. It's time I choose a successor in my job. I choose you, Optimus Prime. I choose you to be the next Santa Claus. I didn't say oh, that. My daughter is going to ask for a piggyback ride home. Really? That's awesome! I will help you deliver this year's presents. But you will be the new Santa Claus from then on. Guys, what do we do about Krampus? Do we leave him here, or do we save him? I'd rather die. Yeah, I say we leave him then. I'll teleport everyone home, but we have work to do, Optimus. Let's go before this lair blows up. Krampus, please come with us. Never. Farewell, brother. I hate you. Tear on my pajamas. Do you think Optimus and Santa will deliver all the presents in time? I think so. I know so. They will. Well, it's midnight. Merry Christmas, everyone. Ho, ho, ho! Ho, ho, ho! Ho, ho, ho! ho. They're back! You should all be in bed. I know when you're awake, you know. Welcome back. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you as well, Ironhide. What happened to Krampus? Krampus is gone. Christmas will never be dark again. So is Optimus now Santa? Yes. Next year, Optimus will have the job of delivering presents across the world. While well, I'm in a posh hotel, getting a massage for my back. So not only do we have to tolerate Optimus celebrating Christmas over the top, but we have to tolerate Optimus being Santa as well. Great. I will do my best to keep your work up, Santa. Ho ho ho, I know you will. This Christmas will be the brightest Christmas ever. I better go and inform everyone of the North Pole about Krampus. An optimist being the new Santa. Merry Christmas!
Merry Christmas, everyone! You too, Prime! Good work on putting the decorations up, everyone. Not bad. You know, not as good as mine, but... Not bad. I can't wait to open these presents! Yes, let's get these presents open, and after, we'll have our Christmas dinner. Merry Christmas, everyone, and a Happy New Year! Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. Merry Christmas. Christmas. Reinhard? Yeah, Prime? I have ideas of planning a party for Christmas Eve this year, but I'll need your help. Do you accept these terms of agreement? Yeah, I, I guess. It was at this moment Einheid realized he messed up. Einheid, I need help planning this party. Be right over, Prime. Einhide! <sighs> Coming. So tired. Need to rest. Einhide, come here, please. Uh... Einhide! Einhide! For the sake of my maker in Hasbro, what? What can you possibly want from me now? <laughs> I can't believe you agreed to help him! You know how much of a fanatic Optimus is about Christmas! Ha! <laughs> you didn't even realize what you were getting yourself into! I didn't really think I was in the heat of the moment. <laughs> heat of the moment? What moment? It was a simple yes or no answer! Yeah, well, I didn't really think what I would have been getting myself in for. Even Grimlock would have the sense to say no to that question. You calling me Grimlock stupid? Me Grimlock not stupid. Grimlock strong. Optimus is stupid one. He planned his party same time he delivers presents. By Hasbro, you're right, Grimlock. Me Grimlock always right. Did Optimus even consider this? Like Grimlock said, while well, the Christmas Eve party is going on, Optimus, who is now the new Santa, will be delivering presents to the whole world. He'll miss his own party. Now I feel better. You plan party same time you deliver presents, you stupid. No. 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 No! Hmm. Sensei, what are you doing? You have been using this iPod Touch for several hours now. 
I am correcting my previous mistake, Drift. Ah, running from one's mistakes and creating a course of action to correct that error. That is most honorable, my sensei. What is it that you are doing anyway, Sensei? I am ordering every single Optimus Prime toy that Transformers Fan 5000 has in his collection as substitutes while I am out delivering presents. Are there versions of you, Sensei? They should be here any minute. They are here. So very quick to arrive. That is most honorable, my sensei. Greetings, Optimus Primes. My name is Movie One Optimus Prime. Well, Sideswipe, I took a month of Christmas work from Prime, but I cannot express my happiness now that he can't make it to his own party. <laughs> Um, Ironhide? Hi there. Where's Optimus Prime? I'm here. 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 I'm here. The one who's obsessed with Christmas. Oh, I, uh, I think he left with Drift to the North Pole. Good. Hopefully he'll stay there too. Hey, where did Grimlock go? Where did Santa hide his sleigh anyway? Sensei, thank you so much for inviting me to help you. I look forward to delivering presents. It is such an honor. Drift, why do you use the words honor and sensei every time you speak? Because it is honorable, my sensei. Well, it's annoying me. Please stop. The honorable thing to do would be to stop so my head doesn't explode from anger. I am sorry, my sensei. I will try to be better. Seriously, where is this sleigh? Ah, over there! Great work, Drift. Now, where's the reindeer? You need no silly reindeer when you have me, Grimlock. By Hasbro, did you follow us here? Hey, you seen the last night yet? Yeah, I did. I saw it last night. Huh. Like I've not heard that one before. No, I'm serious. I watched it last night. It's like my worst nightmare come true. Come on, big guy. It's not that bad. There's only... One, two, three, four... Okay, that's ten, twelve, thirteen... Three hundred... No, forget it. It's bad. Sideswipe, that's not helping. Hey... Megatron's coming. He'll cheer you up. Hey guys, still got these pink pajamas. <laughs> it's like my worst nightmare come true. <sighs> Not sure this is a good idea, Grimlock. Trust me, me smart unlike you. Me strong enough to pull heavy slay. Me can pull slay. You just ate too many Christmas pies for me Grimlock to pull. Ugh, where's Santa when you need him? Ah, just what I always wanted.
a massage in a posh five-star hotel for my back. I know Optimus is a worthy Santa. I trust him. Why did Santa even trust me with his former job? I have no idea what I'm doing. Do not worry. I believe I have figured out a solution. I was heard that the sleigh runs on Christmas spirit. And if there is none, then the sleigh will not be able to fly. Um, Drift. I'm in the sleigh! The most Christmassy person ever! Maybe someone back home is preventing Slave from flying. Ironhide seemed a bit upset earlier. I wonder why. Optimus is calling me. Don't answer it. Relax, it'll be fine. Sideswipe, you need to tell Einheit to stop being such a baby and get into the Christmas spirit already. The sleigh won't fly on low Christmas spirits. I- Bye! He hung up on me. Didn't even get a chance to reply. Don't care. He can stay there for all I care. Just get into the Christmas spirit, you big grump. Just think, when Optimus gets back, you can kill him. How about that? Now I'm feeling the Christmas spirit! It's working! Now we can deliver the presents! Ho ho ho! Me Grimlock pulling sleigh! Merry Christmas everyone! Merry Christmas! Uh, Optimus? Ironhide. Optimus! I, I've been waiting for you. Come here and let me celebrate Christmas with you. Uh, Ironhide? You're acting weird. Ironhide! Why do you always try to kill me? Come here, Prime! Stop running away! Whoa! That was close! Merry Christmas, everyone, and a Happy New Year! Whoa! And so it is. Einheid once again tries to kill his best friend, Optimus Prime. Little does Einheid know that Christmas rage can give power to things beyond this world. At long last! I, the evil center from the South Pole, finally reawakens!
December already? Oh, five more minutes. At long last, I, the evil Santa from the South Pole, finally reawakens. It's the 1st of December. There is plenty of time to put my evil plan into action. Oh, that annoying alarm clock. Time to turn it off. What? It's the 25th of December? How could it be Christmas Day already? I've overlaid by 24 days! Now I have to wait another year, a whole year, until I can restart my plan again. Ugh, it's time to go back to bed. At long last, I, the evil Santa from the South Pole once again, Finally reawakens! <laughs> I am. Oh, for the love of Primus! We know already! You're Optimus Prime! We've heard it a billion times! I think it's more than a billion, Ironhide. If my calculations are correct, from the last Christmas to this Christmas, Optimus has said, I am Optimus Prime. A billion decillion times. Is that even a number? I don't know, but I'm getting tired of it. Ha! I love how last year Drift was all about honor and calling Optimus Sensei. And now Drift does not even give a scrap about Optimus. Optimus, it's safe to say we all hate you. Well, I wouldn't say hate. More like, we all find you annoying. You're like the little brother of a family that you hate when they're around you. But if they move out of the house, you miss them. I don't even know whether that's a sad or sweet thing to say, Sideswipe. If you would all let me explain, I wasn't trying to say I am Optimus Prime. A billion, decillion, and one times. I was trying to say I am Santa Claus. Sure, Optimus. Optimus, what you buy me, Grimlock, for Christmas? Me? I'm not buying you anything this year, Grimlock. Why? Me, Grimlock, demand a present from you, you Santa. You have all the presents in the world. Give me Grimlock one. Because I don't want to buy you anything. Me not speaking to you anymore. I know what I want this year. What's that? A new body. I don't know. I kind of prefer you like this, Ironhide. Makes you more screen accurate after what happened to you in Dark of the Moon. Don't bring those memories up, RC. It's too sad and ironic that I suffered the same fate as my movie self without you rubbing it in my face. I agree with RC. I prefer you like this without a body and all. What was it like to fall apart, old buddy? Horrible! It's cold. I can't even punch Optimus when I'm mad anymore. Optimus, I made you a Santa hat. Thank you, Megatron. Don't even remember what happened to my last hat. Ironhide, what you getting me Grimlock for Christmas? Oh, Grimlock, for the love of my designer, stop asking the same question. It's bad enough Optimus asked me to be a part of this Christmas special, let alone you repeating yourself every two minutes. Bumblebee, the last Christmas special you did was years ago. Yes, because Optimus' stupid obsession with Christmas. I couldn't take it any longer. 
So basically, you left us stranded with him while you and the rest of Transformers Fan 5000's original crew took off? Well... I... you know, when you put it like that, then... yeah. Well, at least we don't have to defeat some evil boss this year like previous years. Sideswipe! I swear, if you've jinxed us... <laughs> Greetings! I'm not tired at all, by the way. I am... Please don't say Optimus Prime. The evil Santa Claus from the South Pole. Thank Primus. And I challenge you, Optimus Prime, to a duel to save or end Christmas. Oh, come on! Not another evil bot we have to defeat. See what happens when you jinx a sideswipe? Sorry. I like this guy already. He could end Christmas. No Christmas. No more over the top celebration! <laughs> evil Santa, stop right there. I have tracked you from one. Oh! Hang on, hang on, my back. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, where was I? Evil Santa, stop right there. I have tracked you from one end of this world to the other. And I will not allow you to do this. You're not Santa anymore. Optimus Prime is. And if he wishes to save Christmas, he will meet me at these coordinates. Or I shall destroy Christmas. Some other way. Somehow. I don't know how, but trust me, I'll think of something good. Goodbye for now. <laughs> Coordinates? What coordinates? He told us to meet him there. But he never even gave us a location to go to! What do we do? We must recruit a helping hand. Who? Krampus. Thought he was dead! <laughs> yeah. About that, I forgot to mention it last year. You see, neither Krampus or I can actually die. You know, since we both share a split spark. The only way we can die is if we both die at the exact same time. But Krampus is evil! Yeah, but Krampus and Evil Santa are sworn enemies. Plus, the coordinates Evil Santa gave us was the location of Krampus's lair, which also wasn't destroyed like you thought, which I also forgot to mention last year. Evil Santa is more powerful than Krampus, so Krampus is going to want us to help him eradicate Evil Santa from his lair. And only a being of Christmas light, only a being of pure Christmas light, like myself, you know, not, not, um, not belittling anyone, but I am a, a very, a very, you know, I'm, I'm a great being of light here. But any, anyway, back to the point. Only being of Christmas light can defeat such a, a dark entity. I shall defeat Evil Santa with the Christmas Matrix. Optimus, you're making that up. Yeah, there's no way that's a thing. Wait until you see it then. Now, we must not waste time. I am Transformers 2007 Movie 1 Voyager Optimus Prime. <gasps> and now, I will, I mean, I mean we, we will save Christmas one more time. Let's roll out. <laughs> Oh, brother, <coughs> you came for me. Everyone, raise your weapons and shoot Evil Santa down. Come on, raise your weapons. I don't want to do this on my own. 
How do you expect us to do that? I'm holding Ironhide's head and I only have one arm. Yeah. And the rest of us left our weapons back at base. Since they're all plastic and spring-loaded, they have no effect on an enemy other than making them angry. So, you could have at least thrown them at him? Optimus, we're the most unreliable soldiers ever. Our throws would have probably missed anyway. Optimus! I mean, Santa! Step forward and fight me. I will. I am Optimus! Ouch. That was slightly embarrassing. Don't think this makes us friends. I just need your help to reclaim my base again. Likewise. I kind of feel a little awkward just standing here watching. I mean, we could help them, but... Nah! I mean, I... I could help, but... You know, my... My back's aching, and... Um, and, uh... It, it, it looks like Optimus and Krampus sort of have it under control? Uh, ooh. Against both Santa and Krampus, I stand victorious. All I want is my base back. Is that too much to ask? You're not victorious yet. Not before I have a chance to use the Christmas Matrix. I can't wait to see what he does for this. It's gonna be so bad. While I have no real Matrix that has the power of the universe inside it, I do have the Christmas Matrix. My hand, offering you a handshake of peace. Christmas is a season of coming together and celebrating peace without fighting and killing. Will you accept this peace offering and celebrate Christmas with us from now on? Because every year we defeat an enemy, and every year we get a new and more powerful enemy in return. Will you accept my truce? This is the only time Optimus has ever acted seriously. I hope it lasts. To scrap with over the top Christmas Prime. Why would I do that? Because... Well, because Christmas is the most magical time of the year. There's no way he'll agree to. You know what? Okay. All I ever wanted to do was to celebrate, but my evil personality has prevented me from doing it. Let us help you then, evil Santa. Krampus, what about you? Can we help you too? Uh, oh, what the heck. I'm well overdue a Christmas meal anyway. We finally made peace with the evil guys we've been fighting for years. And it was so easy. All we ever needed was a Christmas handshake. And while peace is finally made, there is an unsettled warrior within their ranks. Peace, huh? I guess if you want something done right, you need to do it yourself. No matter. Once I get my new body next Christmas, I will take matters into my own hands, and I will finally be able to kill Optimus, unlike my previous attempts. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone! You too, Megs. I can't wait to open all these presents. Here, Krampus, have this plastic spring-loaded axe that transformed into a gun. You can use it if you ever need to kill someone. I can already think of more than one bot to kill. Grimlock, I have a present for you. Present for me, Grimlock? You really think I wouldn't get you a Christmas present? I didn't want to ruin the surprise for you. Here, Merry Christmas, Grimlock. Yay! Me, Grimlock, got dangerous weapon thingy. I'm proud of you, Optimus Prime. You've brought me 
my brother and his worst enemy together as one happy family. I'm proud to call you a brother of my own. Thank you, Santa. See, Einhide, I always told you to have faith in my Christmas abilities. I can't wait for next Christmas. Neither can I, Prime. Trust me, neither can I. Anyway, to all of you at home, thanks for stopping by, and we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. Merry, Christmas. Christmas. Merry Christmas! 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 Previously on the Transformers Christmas Specials. I'm tired of this. This ends here. I tried to kill Optimus last year, and that didn't work. I don't think anything will stop Optimus from celebrating. Every time we're with Optimus at Christmas, something always goes wrong. We'll all have to celebrate Christmas without him. I'm hiding. Why do you always try to kill me? Come here, Prime. Stop running away. Once I get my new body next Christmas, I will take matters into my own hands, and I will finally be able to kill Optimus, unlike my previous attempts. <laughs> Ah, the decorations are up. At least you didn't plan your Christmas party at the same time as delivering the presents this year. <laughs> oh, don't even remind me of that, Braun. You idiot last few Christmas, Optimus. Grimlock, you do realize that I'm Santa? I could easily put you on the naughty list. You wouldn't dare. Me, Grimlock, got my dinos by my side this year. Right, boys? Yes! Right. Hmm. Something on your mind, Prime? I have a Christmas hypothesis. Oh, a hypothesis? Did I hear someone mention science? I can help. I'm the super smart scientist Wheeljack, who knows absolutely everything there is to know about anything and everything. Jeez, Jackie, I know you've got selective hearing, but at least give science a rest when it's Christmas time. Yeah, your over-enthusiasm, it kind of creeps me out and just makes me want your help less. Science is the thing I'm made for, King Santa. 
tell me, what's the hypothesis you've got? Well, you see, if we get some Predacons together and... At last! Finally, my new body has arrived. Now, once I transfer my mind into this body, I will finally have the deadly firepower and physical strength to kill Optimus Prime forever. Now to transfer my mind. Finally, now it is time. And by applying those factors, I can have the Predacons turned into efficient reindeer like the flyers for your sleigh within just three days! Oh Hasbro, please tell me my receipt is still valid for return. I need to get out of here. I've heard some things in my life, but that? I don't even know how to respond anymore. Wheeljack, we can't just turn the Predacons into reindeer. Of course we can! Science, Primey, science! Science makes anything possible! Did I mention I'm a scientist? Oh, please, just shoot me now. Stop talking science. Me not understand, and you talk too fast. Ugh, fine. We'll use the Dinobots instead. You really are crazy, aren't you? I got an idea. Why don't we wrap you up in wrapping paper so you can't get out? Statistically speaking, I have swords and my scientific ability to- I got an idea. How about I kill Optimus so we have no more Christmas and therefore no more problems? Oh, cool. You finally got your new body, I see. <sighs> well, I'm bored. Yes! What? Taking Optimus out of the equation would solve most of our problems. <laughs> well, good enough for me. What? How did you do that? You've been trying to kill me for the past nine years. I know your exact intentions. Plus, we're action figures. We only have a limited range of movement, you know. They're not even surprised or scared? Nope. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. But I'm gonna kill you. Good luck, buddy. There's a 0% reoccurring chance that you will fail. We'll see. Many, 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 many attempts later. Well, I'm all out of ideas. What seems to be the problem? I can't kill Optimus. I waited a whole year for my new body, and it's useless. I know how you feel. I snooze through my alarm for an entire year when I plan to destroy Christmas. And now look at you. The once most feared now all chilling together as one. Hey! We just found our festive spirit. Why'd you lose yours? When Christmas became a thing for Optimus. Well, what do you like most about Christmas? When Optimus isn't here. Let me ask you something. Have you ever truly celebrated with Optimus? Um, a long time ago? I used to be Santa. And I know that you enjoy this time of year. You're his best friend, and you his. Rekindle that bond, and Christmas will once again be meaningful to you. You're saying Optimus is the source of my Christmas spirit? Only you can figure that out. Hmm... Huh. Optimus is the source of his Christmas spirit. Sounds really sad, doesn't it? <laughs> yep. Optimus, it has come to my attention that if I try to kill you again, it will fail. Called it. Uh, 
Yeah. So that would mean next year I'd attempt to do the same, and it would be a never-ending cycle. I propose a truce between them. Wait! Optimus, put your hand out. You too, Ironhide. A Christmas handshake. Proof, once again, it works. <laughs> okay, well, now I'm surprised, to say the least, Ironhide. Why? Because why should I want to kill my best friend for doing what he loves the most? Uh, you know what? You don't need to say it. I think we all preferred it when they were at each other's throats. Anything is better than this heartwarming moment. It's too cringy and loving. Glad to finally see eye to eye, my old friend. You too, Prime. You too. Huh. <sighs> The holiday spirit really changes the mood, doesn't it? Would you like a scientific statistical report on how the holiday season affects brain chemistry? No! no! So, will you help me celebrate Christmas? Yes! This? <laughs> oh, this is either gonna go really good or really bad, depending on your perspective. Oh boy! The Christmas Eve bells! That means it's finally time to deliver presents. It is. Everyone, get ready to raise your Christmas spirit to allow the sleigh to fly. Grimlock, would you and your dinos like to pull the sleigh? Yeah! Yeah! Yes! Ho, ho, me Grimlock when do I get a press? Me Grimlock pulling sleigh. Me Grimlock pulling sleigh. What a great night of delivering presents. I agree. Say, every year we defeat an enemy and a new Christmas grump comes along. Who's next? <laughs> Don't even jinx it, Einheit, please, for the love of Hasbro, it's not even funny anymore. I may be ten years old, but man, do I still love opening presents. Move out of way! Me excited! Presents! Presents! By my scientific calculations and my scientific brain, the Dinobots will never outgrow their childlike behavior. Not everything needs to be explained in science terms, young one. Go forth, and open the dimension of wrapping paper, and turn it into a combination of imagination and reality. Ah, who am I kidding? Presents! Hey, if Ironhide got his Studio Series figure as a new body, can I get the new Studio Series tanker truck version of me? My right arm is practically holding on by a thread here. In fact, look. You can visibly see the wear and tear and tracks on the joint. Look! Well, why not open your present and find out what you've got? Oh my, a new body! Christmas pylon! You're the star on top of the tree, Stormy! Well, we finally worked together, Prime! We did, and now it's time to open our presents too. And then we shall have our Christmas dinner. Anyway, to all of you at home, we all hope you have a Merry Christmas and the most happiest of New Year as we enter this new decade. Merry Christmas and here's to 2020! Ho, ho, ho! Merry, Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, you filthy animals! 2020. And here's to 2020! Ho, 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 Merry ho, Christmas! Ho, and here's to 2020! Or whatever, I don't, I don't care. Me? Me? Him? Uh, never mind. Just tell me, what day is it? Today? Well, it's Christmas Day, sir! Uh, no need for that language, sir. 
Let us light up your morning. Yeah, less of bah humbug and more of ba weep prana weep ninny bun. Oh, hey guys, what did I miss? Guys, guys, I brought the fruitcake. Guys? Oh, bloody hell, I can't believe I missed another Christmas special. Oh well, maybe next year. Um, this is a bit awkward. Primus bless us everyone, I guess. Goodbye. Okay, guys, we got a serious problem here. We've ran out of villains to destroy Christmas. So we need one of you to go about and do some, well, whatever it is you used to do. Aw, oh, come on, man. I love Christmas now. There's no need to destroy Christmas, Sideswipe. Let us embrace the holiday peace. Megatron? Come on, Megatron, please! For once, we actually need you to be center stage and not just an extra in pink pajamas. Wait, I am... I am an extra? Sideswipe! Leave! You can insult us, but you do not insult the pink pajamas that is the true spirit of Christmas! There, there. I'm not an extra! <laughs> I'm the main man! Ask anyone! Uh, <laughs> Megatron! Fine! At this rate, I might have to put Ironhide back in that headless body of his. Don't you dare! Actually, never mind. We got someone. I hate Christmas. Just ah. the words I wanted to hear. Where'd you come from? Okay, get yourself ready for scene three. What do you mean? If you don't change three? your ways, you'll die. What in the? Hmm. Something does seem to be missing, though. Wait a minute. Oh well, I'm sure I'll think of what it is later. Is okay, this another lights, Christmas camera, special? action. Wait, what? How did I... What sort of magic is this? Hello there? Who goes there? Show yourself! If this is you, Cyclonus, it's not funny. Stars... Must be dreaming. Surely one of the twins must have knocked me out or something. Scourge, you have been deemed too dark for Christmas, but you have been given a second chance. 
See these? The chains I bear. Each one an attempt to try and overthrow Megatron. I see your chains from beyond. Building and building and building all the time. You have a chance to escape my fate. How can I escape such a fate? You must take a look at yourself and see what you become. You will be visited by three spirits tonight who will show you the monster you are. Three? I'd rather not. Then you will have chains of eternal length. You'll die in misery and all alone. If you accept this opportunity, you have a chance to avert your fate. If only you open your heart. Oh, okay, okay. You win. In order for me to get out of this nightmare, I guess I have no choice. I see now that there's no option for me but to continue this damn video's plot. I'll do it. And so, strike the tolls of one, two, and three. The spirits shall come. Hello. Ah! What? What? I mean, <clears throat> who are you? I am the ghost of Christmas past. They did try to get Bumblebee for this role, but Transformers fan 5000 didn't have the Titans Return Legends figure, so... What in Unicron's dark pits are you doing? I am here to show you the horrors that have plagued you all your life. Listen, or do not listen. But know that if you don't change your ways, you will die. Die? I'm a piece of plastic. I'm basically the, the embodiment of invincibility. Well, unless of course I get burnt or Transformers fan somehow steps on me. But, but still, why does everyone keep saying I'm going to die? This is you. Your past. Uh, no spirit. I really hate to burst your bubble, but just... No, that that's Thundercracker. I I am a totally different toy to him. Just go with it. You're doing great. <laughs> bah humbug. This this must be some kind of trick. I must be dreaming. I remember this. Me and Sky used to be the best buds. Until he left to join the Decepticons. And I had to stay in cyber school and study. <laughs> Poetry. I was never the same once I went inside that dreadful place. Skybite made sure of that. Whatever happened to Skywarp? Do you remember what happened next? Take me back, spirit. No more. Please. You must see. <clears throat> Mr. Hasbro, sir. We made Cyclonus a Voyager class figure in Combiner Wars, and Galvatron is as well in the current Titan's return line. Therefore, Scourge should be moved from Deluxe to Voyager class. What's cheaper? Well, er, if you're talking about cutting costs on materials, then the Deluxe would be- Then make him a Deluxe! But Mr. Hasbro, sir! The fans won't be pleased with us if we make two of the Unicron Heralds Voyagers and the other a Deluxe. They'll rebel on us online again. It saves me money! So make them cheap! Those sucker fans will buy it anyway! It's not like some third party will make a better upscaled version. What was that? Nothing. And so, we see the dark, sad truth that has plagued you for years. I, I'm a good figure. Transformers fan 5000 says I am. Just ask him. Ask any of his friends. Why do you torture me with these visions of the past? Because no longer can you allow your sadness of the Hasbro team's design choices to impact your spirit of the holidays. 
My time is coming to an end here, but know this: if you do not learn from your past that I have shown you, you will. Let me guess. Die. I was going to say it won't get you anywhere, but yes, that also. My time is up. I wish you the best, Scrooge. I mean, Scourge. Learn the lessons taught tonight, and you'll become your true self. The next spirit will show you the impact in today's timeline of what I have shown you here. Fear not, only embrace. Hey, bud, you awake? I need food. You got some? Just in the fridge, there's some plant-based vegan foods and... Wait a microsecond. Just who are you? I'm the ghost of Christmas present. I'm just waiting for some idiot to show up so I can show him what a huge scraphead he is. Language! One, you're eating none of my food. Two... I'm the scraphead idiot you speak of. Language. And three... Uh, whatever. Just get on with it. Oh, my bad. Well, I'm here to show you your present self. Correct your ways. Give to those who are less fortunate than you are. Like me, for example. Here, we have your fridge, filled with a whole lot of goodness for the stomach. You have lots and lots of food. You can give to the less fortunate by donating to the Hound Cause. Hound Cause? Wait, you mean like... dogs? Because I mean there's Dalmatians, German Shepherds, uh, Poodles, Chihuahuas, and... Wait... YOUR HOUND! Truth be told, I only accepted this role because I was told there was cake. Get out of my kitchen, you fat- And so it shows. You have no kindness in your spark. Kindness? You broke into my house. You tried to eat all my food. You're basically an intruder to my home. Why should I show you kindness? You have shown no act of kindness or giving here. I cannot help you any more than I already have. You, you've not helped me in the slightest. You ask for food and are bailing. I only hope the ghost of Christmas yet to be can save you now. Um, bug! This is a waste of my time. I could be asleep right now. Next thing you know, the next spirit is just gonna pop out of nowhere and just go, Oh, look at me, I am I am so spooky and scary that I should belong in the Halloween special of blah, 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 blah. Ghosts. A lot of rubbish. Did it help me? Show me my darkest moments, broke to my home, uh, to Halloween with a lot of them. <sighs> One spirit left. Wait till he goes, and then I can live the rest of my life in peace. Curses, Starscream. I really hope this last one shows me something worthwhile, or this whole video is just a total waste of time. It's a whole bunch of baloney, if you ask me. The ghost is right behind me, isn't he? Uh-uh. <laughs> I predicted this, and yet, I was not prepared for it. Anyway. <clears throat> I see you are the final spirit. Gotta admit, since it's a Christmas special, I was expecting Santa. So, spirit, are we going to do anything, or are we just gonna stand here all day long? Because, I mean, I could offer you a chair. Well, fine, I'll guess I'll sit myself. A buck. <laughs> no, but please, no. <laughs> this can't be. <laughs> okay, okay, I was spiteful. I was ashamed of who I was, 
and you set aggression on everyone who was perfect. I see that now. I'm sorry. No spirit. Please, no. No. Please, spirit. Please. I beg of you. Give me another chance. Please. No! Spare me, spirit. I see that now. For I want to refuse and ignore is now open. Please, I'm not the toy I was, was. Look into my heart. I was wrong. I'm sorry. Where... where am I? Am I d dead? Spirit? Where are you? Am I dead? No, nope. you're very much alive! Yeah. What was all that screaming and crying about? Uh... it was... it was nothing, Megatron. I was just watching a very scary, sad movie. Um... Uh... A Christmas special, actually. Um... Claws, I think it was. Very scary. Anyway, you there. Tell me, what day is it? You already asked us that, sir! It's Christmas Day, sir! I... I am alive. From now on, I promise to be a better toy. You two, go to an online website and buy Transformers Fan 5000, a present under my name. It's about time now for me to give. The time for selfish greed is over! Uh, 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 make sure the present is the, the, the Studio Series Scourge. I, I think it's time for an upgrade. I can't believe we're finally having Christmas in the Decepticon base! About time! <laughs> I am here to destroy Christmas! You're too late! I already found a Christmas grump for this year. Uh, wait, you did? Oh, well, I'd much rather celebrate Christmas. Well, that's pretty much a wrap. Good work, guys, and... I just realized what was missing. And what's that? Optimus! He normally makes an appearance in the very first few seconds on the episodes. Ha! We actually had an Optimus-free Christmas special for once. How's that? Side swipe! You're actually a bad luck charm. You jinx us every single year with something. That'll be the guests arriving. No. No. No! And here I am again, the Christmas Special 2020. Ten years, and I'm still the main character! All of us Decepticons, South Poles, North Poles, whoever you are, episode viewers, I don't know, um, we're going to celebrate Christmas once more! Presents are delivered, and all is well. I am Optimus Prime! I'm actually gonna kill you after the credits roll, Sideswipe. I hope you don't mind, I brought some guests. Well, even if you did mind, it's uh, it's too late now because they're already here. And um, I'm Santa, so um, I decide what happens. Now I see why everyone has such a distaste for you, Christmas Prime. The other guests are outside. Let's let them in. Wait, is is this Five Thousand's entire collection? You bet it. How did you even get them all here? And. More importantly, how is the set able to fit every single character here? Is the Autobot base more smaller than, like, ours? 
I'll just put them all in my sleigh sack. Figured if it can carry the world's presents, uh, it can carry his collection. Well, most of it anyway. Wait. Wouldn't it have been easier to move us and this set we're in to 5,000th room? Instead of rather than transporting everyone here? Like, seriously, that really doesn't make a lot of logical sense. Hmm. That does actually make sense, but you're overlooking one important factor. I am Santimus Prime. Make up your mind. Are you Santa? Are you Optimus? Are you Santimus? Or... Don't start him off. I am... Oh, for Spark's sake. Optimus Prime! Now, let's invite everyone in and have our Christmas dinner. Vegan, of course. No more turkeys. Well, I don't intend to throw away this second chance I've been given. So drop the presents, drop the dinner plates, and let's celebrate! Ho, ho, ho! I'm so glad to see the true spirit of Christmas be bright in you again, Scourge. And so it is, once more. The stars of Transformers celebrate Christmas again, for the tenth time. And, as you may have already guessed, this is the tenth anniversary. And me, Transformers Fun 5000, his group of voice actors and actresses, all wish you the merriest of Christmases, and the most happiest of New Years. Thank you for the support over the last nine years. And here's to another 10 years. Stay safe, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and a happy new year. Merry, Merry Christmas! This is a wonderful Christmas. Yes, oh, happy, happy Christmas. Steve? 
What are you doing here? Oh, Lord Megatron. I'm here for the Christmas special. I've been late every year and I miss it. So I thought I'd get myself here early this year. Early? The intro hasn't even rolled yet. Ah, there we go. I... I can't believe he's gone. He was a friend to all. And he loved Christmas. He, w he wouldn't want us to mourn him. He'd want us to celebrate the holidays for all, and honour his memory and legacy. He came in a two-pack with me. Gosh, with being sealed in that box with him a life sentence. He just went on and on. But me and him, we were one of 5,000's original figures. And for that I can say he was a true crime. <laughs> Grimlock. <laughs> not going to get present this year. <laughs> he was... Uh, we fought a lot. But he was always there for me, as a true friend. Born in this body, die in this body, he said. Not gonna be doing one of those cheap body swaps to keep my character arc going like others in previous years. He had to get one last dig on me before he passed. I mean... Seems we're all going around in a circle talking now, so... Uh... Um... He was... A good... Figure. Strong plastics. Good engineering for his time. Decent light piping. I didn't really know him all that well. I kinda stole some of his spotlight last year. And a little preview at the end of 2019. That episode. But... I'm not really sure what else to say. Grampus. He was okay, I guess. Yeah, but he couldn't fight for scrap. If anything, his most deadly weapons were his ego and his mouth. Enough to drive anyone to insanity. Uh, cause of death? Gold plastic syndrome. Um, I hate to interrupt, but he wasn't made of gold plastic. You're ruining the moment, Steve. Oh, blimey. Sorry, mate. The Christmas specials will never be the same without him. We will remember you. Transformers 2007 movie, Voyager Class 2-Pack Optimus Prime. What the Christmas? I knew my plan was foolproof. Amazing plan! What is going on? You're meant to be dead! I'm meant to have the spotlight this year! It, no! It's my time! I thought we worked through this ages ago. Let me guess, you plan to fake your death for a while now? Well, yes and uh, no. You see, I know I'm the star of the show, but I just wanted to hear you all say how important I was to you all. Not to boost my ego, but I, I wanted to hear, that's all. I told you. Egotistical, narcissistic scrapheads. The lot of you! Maintain that attitude and the three ghosts will reappear for you. Bring them on! Once I upgrade to the Studio Series Scourge, no ghosts will harm me. But you still haven't got your Studio Series figure yet, have you? <laughs> okay, that's enough character development for you. Let me speak now. So what villain are we up against this year? Galvatron? Unicron? Draculus in a Santa costume? None. Aw, oh, serious? I kinda like the Evil Boss storylines, you know, like the one where there was that one bad guy, and there was this other one where... Yeah, he was pretty bad too. Well, firstly, we don't want to repeat the same story over and over again. And two, if we have a break from fighting evil bosses, we won't be on top of our game when the next boss appears, meaning we'll all have to overcome our own obstacles and challenges when a threat does happen to appear, making the next story more dramatic. So, what's the plan for this year's story? I thought a nice throwback to the first two Christmas specials would be a good idea, 
have a nice and relaxing fourth wall breaking and no villain fighting Christmas. A throwback remembrance to the Christmas specials that kickstarted this Christmas journey. A great idea. Me Grimlock still get presents, right? Hey, you know what I was thinking? Why don't we have a quick montage while we're putting up the decorations? Oh, I guess. Hmm. Oh, maybe this could go here. Ah. Hmm. That looks great. Well, I'm ready for Santa to come. Actually, he's already here. He's right over there. Yes, he is. Oh boy, it's my first Christmas special. I'm ever so excited. Me, Grimlock's getting presents from you all, right? Right? Because if me, Grimlock, don't, me do to you what Transformers fandom want do to G1 Wheelie. I cannot wait for... Oh, what the... Who the heck left this rotten fruitcake here? Oh, sorry, your lordship. That's the fruitcake I brought that one year I didn't make it. You left this here? It's rotten! This fruitcake was on the last base. An entirely different set. How has it ended up here, next to my foot? Well, excuse me, Lord Megatron, but I made this cake from the goodness of me plastic heart. Man, am I good at making fruitcakes. I should go into business. Steve's Fruitcakes. Nice ring to it, don't you think? I think you shouldn't just leave cake around to rot. You truly are the spirit of Christmas, Optimus Prime. All these years of retirement are doing my back wonders. It doesn't even crack anymore. Glad to hear it. You've done a grand job again this year, Optimus. You've got the dinner ready, you've put all the interior and exterior decorations up, you've raised people's spirits. Say, your timing is so impeccable this year, I didn't even see you deliver the presents. Oh, scrap! Me demand more presents for all that flying, Optimus. A new record time, Grimlock. Great job. Now, I'm just gonna paint a red nose on you. Oi, Optimus. Would you like to be the first of many to try my awesome fruitcakes? Oh boy, would I. I'm starving. All that flying. Give, uh... Make sure you give Grimlock a slice with carrots or something. I'm trying to turn him into a real reindeer. Fruitcakes, get your fruitcakes here. If you don't like them, you can use them as a paperweight or a door stopper. These things last forever. You bet your sweet bottomless energon I'd like a slice. How much? Boy, that'll be $10.99, please. Bargain? How much are they normally? One ninety-nine. Nice! Wait a minute. Next, please. What's a rip Mmm, yummy! I'm gonna leave you a review on TF Wiki, Me, Steve. Me, Grimlock, starving. Out of Grimlock way, otherwise Grimlock eat your head. Me Grimlock starving! Me want your entire stock. Said Bill to Optimus. He say it cool. Hi there, you're my number one customer, Grimlock. At this rate, my new business will be an absolute success. That'll be $909,999, please. Come again soon. Fruitcakes, get your fruitcakes here. If you don't like them, you can chuck them at an enemy. They weigh more than any bullet ever could. Fruitcakes, fruitcakes, get your fruitcakes here. Oh, is this the end already? Dang it. Boy, Christmas does fly by. Is this the bit where everybody makes the big speech at the end? You bet. Since everyone wants the spotlight, I think it's only fair we all say something at the end of the special. <laughs> 
Finally, for once, we can all agree. And again, the Christmas crew have done it. Presents delivered, dinner eaten, and Steve's business has already taken off. Where on Cybertron is that voice coming from? Is it the sky? Is it a bird? Is it a plane? <gasps> no! It's Transformers Fan 5000! Hi, mate! Hello, viewers! Merry Christmas! Hi, Mum! If I have a Mum! This is the 11th Christmas special. We're now onto the next decade of Christmas specials. The support on all the past specials has been both incredible and very much appreciated. As we enter this new era, the content will continue. The story will continue, and most of all, Christmas will continue. We will continue to grow, and with this new decade, will come many, many stories, with many characters having both their ups and their downs, telling unique stories, and most importantly, telling the story of Transformers. A young fan, once aged eight years old, ones could have only dreamed of. Hey guys, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays from me, Wheeljack. Happy Christmas for everybody in the UK. I don't know why you say it like that. I like Merry Christmas, but whatevs. Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night. And to our Canadian viewers, Happy Boxing Day. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and Happy Holidays to Merry Christmas everyone. everyone, Merry Christmas everyone, Merry Christmas everyone, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. Me Grimlock love fruitcake, and me Grimlock want wish you Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. <sighs> wow, we really did it. Merry Christmas, and a Happy Holidays. Merry Christmas, and a Evil New Year. And also a happy holidays. All oh, these pink pajamas, I love them. Merry Christmas, I am Ratchet. Merry Christmas, I am Starscream. I should be put on the top of the tree because I am Starscream. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. I am the star of the show, even though Starscream is a star, he thinks he should be on the tree, but no, I am Optimus Prime. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas, and uh, welcome to the next 10 years of Christmas specials. Yes. Oh, alright. Merry Christmas, everyone, and have a pleasant new year. And hopefully one that doesn't involve COVID like it did for the last two years. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and Happy Holidays. Well, I'm not the best at these kind of messages, but... Merry Christmas, everybody! From every Decepticon... Wait a minute. Um... Yeah, you know, just from me, mine wife. Merry Christmas, everybody!
A skull cruncher. Where are you? I got your return letter that said you would be here. Where are you, skull cruncher? <gasps> I know that donkey. You're the one who attacked Skull Cruncher! Where is he? Did you send him offline into the depths of Primus just so you could be invited here to take his place? Oh well, it's okay, at least his invite didn't go to waste.